until Carolina Ash comes back. And Angie and Bill said they would help us put away. I need one of those things that go like this and sharpen it up. But I think. Oh, no, you'd be too dangerous. <laughs> <laughs> no, everybody thinks I'm dangerous. I'm safe. Kind of. Okay. I just can't figure out how to. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, I need to short, I need to put a new blade in. I'll figure it out tonight. Um, okay, we have. I just got to count. We have four packages. Oh, I got to not forget that one. One, two. How many's behind there? I forgot. There's a bunch of boxes back there. Three, four, four, four At boxes. Least four. Okay, I can't so see if two four, there. five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. 17, 18 boxes. I gotta raise the cam up. Okay, I think we'll be here till 8 o'clock. I hope not. <laughs> I got early, early morning tomorrow. Okay, there we go. Yeah. <laughs> should have put your jammies on first. I agree. I should have put my jammies on first. There's some heavy ones here. So I'm hoping, I think I know what some of these heavy ones are. And it's one of our top needed items, so I'm hoping I'm right on it. So Amazon is doing something different here. It says, lift your remove. Okay, that means there's a name on these. On these. Hold gently. Oh, forget about <laughs> gently. There we go. Yaha. We got it. But I don't have a name on it. <laughs> but Joe's on there and Joe said something about six boxes are from her, so you guys are gonna have to put Canton yes. Canton and Carolina Ash informed. Yeah, this awesome. Our poor US USA guy. Our poor US <laughs> UPS guy. It's been a long day, trust me. Just came. Just like, two, well, you guys saw me bring the boxes in. And uh, he uh, had more to go yet. You can tell it's starting to get Christmas box season. This is 28 pounds of the double duty. This is really good cap kitty litter. It's an arm and hammer. And I'm kind of thinking, guessing, maybe hoping pretty sure that some of these other ones are also uh, in dog room. Oh, all in dog room. room yep. So the doggies have to move over a little bit. And that's what we have here too, but I don't have a name. Um, is somebody claiming the litter yet? that white little box there so I can see the chat a little better. Cool. I sent four litters. Deb did, yes. I saw Deb's thing. So there's there's another one of the Arm and Hammer. Deb, are those the ones that you sent? They're really big. I'm just, yeah. Okay. And we'll just do the rest of those. Uh, I, you know, tomorrow or the next time that UPS guy comes, I have to give him a treat because he looked pretty bedraggled tonight. So kind of sorry for the guy. Yeah, we were. Remember when we went out? What was it? A, two weeks ago and got all that litter. We were almost out of it already. Yeah. Another. What? How many times is that? Twenty-eight. Yeah. Twenty. Another twenty-eight. So that's three of those big ones. In shipping, Joe, you saved one hundred thirty-three dollars in shipping. Oh my gosh! Yeah, both Deb and Joe sent litter. Now this one also has the same. I think there's some more litter ones down there too. So I bet you these are Joe and um, who is it? And uh, oh my gosh, my brain went went blank. Deb, Joe and Deb. Yeah, this is good. I like this litter. If the kitties tell me, and I know it clumps hard. We like we hard we like hard clumping litter. I put my neck out during the night last night, so Bill fixed me up already. 
And that's why they're helping too, so I don't have to lug those, <laughs> lug those clear around. Well, those doing the heavy duty work. We got, I think there's even another really heavy one over there. This one, oh yeah. So this is number four of this kind. Five. This is number five of this. Double duty. Boy, we're going to smell good around here. Because it says right on the box, it does the pee and the poop. Yeah, look at this. Oh, you guys are awesome. This is like a breath of fresh air. We don't have we don't have to buy litter tomorrow. <laughs> What's that? That's six, right? And seven. This is yeah. And I think six. Bill, I think that one up there okay. might be a litter too, maybe. And I didn't peek. The only way I know is because they're heavy. Oh yeah. You know some of these um, heavy ones that might be litter came yesterday. You know we didn't get to do boxes, so maybe <laughs> I'm, I know these are two different orders. And we got a pig on this one without a name, though. But I think we got it figured out. Okay, so this means I can tell they lit kitties they can use the litter box now. I told them mid-afternoon they had to stop. No potty in. Hey, we're, set on, we're set on brown paper, too, for a while. Wait, is that eight? Yeah. This makes me happy. Getting litter. Getting litter makes me happy. I hear you, Einstein. Wow. Nine. This will definitely get us through some good good days up <laughs> ahead. That's that's real. have you tried that litter? That's that's good. Oh my gosh, here's another one. Yeah, that's good litter. It clumps hard, keeps the smell gone. And, uh, and it doesn't um, break up. Yeah, we don't have the names. So that's 10? I think so. Well, that would make sense. Can you say one, ten, six, another ten, four? Yeah. Ten. Yep, that's 10, ten boxes of litter. So is that from, do we, we've got it down? Hi, Caroline Ash, I see you're there. 280 pounds. 280 pounds of litter. That's cool. That's cool. Yeah, they, they, I told them already they can use the litter box now, so they're breathing a sigh of fresh air. We won't be here soon, but. <laughs> Kitties and litter and food all go together. Okay, we've got three boxes down there as well. Wow, okay, that was cool. Yep, those are what makes my day. Yeah, I won't have to get them tomorrow, get it tomorrow. And what's nice about that too is because when I have to go get it, if Kurt, if Kurt's not able to get it for me, um, I have to lug it too, I have to carry it. Yay, we got a name. Oh, this is from our friend Clarice G. Yeah, in Michigan. Oh, I wonder if Clarice is on. Uh, Yep, this is Clarice. She take, helps take care of us, too. And this got put on our shopping list today. Isn't that neat? I love that when when I put something on our list that we have to get, and we get it before we have to go, just like all that litter. And check this out. Oh, these are those giant ones. These are giant. Uh, the next giant ones come to 75. These are the 105. So, Clarice, if you're on, we love these. You know, this um, this whole entire year has been um, not one of our, but has been the healthiest year we've ever had in, what, the 11 or 12 years that we've been doing this. And I, I just am really happy about that. You know where those are. They can probably stay in the box. I think they'll have to. So thank you, Clarice. Uh, this one is another Amazon. I signed this. You pull bananas in there. Oh, this is 
something else we needed. Oh my gosh. This is cool. This, um, I don't have a name on here. This is Fancy Feast. And you know, with like Canton and uh, Carolina Ash doing the writing down, it helps me a lot because I don't have to try to keep track of this and keep track of who did, who sent it. So it's, uh, it's two cases of Fancy Feast. And I appreciate that. I know you guys asked me uh, last week or whenever that was what we were getting low on. And we were, at that time, I think we were on only two crates of um, baby uh, kitten fancy feast and no adults. So we've got two more here. Again, this week we got three of them from someone. And now we have two more. Um, it's okay, it's okay. Theory just probably about 20 minutes ago came out of her pen. Her name is S A R I, and so we have two two of them. It's, uh, both of them are classy, and that's uh, two cases of fancy piece for us. Thank you. Do we know who did that? And I do find out if you guys are on and you put it on the chat, then uh, Carolina Ash will put it out. Oh, she was on earlier. Okay. Oops. I don't think this is from a webcam. I think this might be one of my drug orders, maybe. I think. I'm not sure. Oh, yeah, this is my frontline order. This one's no fun. Bill, can you put this in the burn one, the paper one? Yeah. This is just I I ordered I didn't realize it said Mary Alto just right then. That goes in the jeans room. That's our uh, front line order. So that means seventeen boxes. Eighteen with that one. I'm gonna get a few of the boxes that was here from yesterday. Whoop, oh oh Siri, Siri, it's all right, honey. You wanna back up in your pen? Yes, you want a little comfort. Because I got out and it's a little bigger adventure than I thought. Isn't she pretty? Very pretty. Okay, what are you doing, Zelda Belda girl? Zelda Zelda. Whoops. Oh, I misplace these all the time. I know, a, a GPS or thing on it. I'm trying to do. These are. Oh, here's an Amazon one. Do you hear on this one? Yeah. Mama! He cracks me up. Who's talking about? Um, me. Yeah. <laughs> oh, yes. Yeah. I don't have a name on it, but this is that purple fancy piece that they really like. It's uh, a whole case. Is this a 24 o'clock? Of, um, of Fancy Feast, or with, or Fritzy, I'm sorry, Fritzy. I hope we're getting names on some of these. And the Fancy, so we had the litter, the Fancy Feast, and now a case of the Fritzy. Cool. And I'm thinking that might be all of the food. These boxes look real interesting. This one is from Petco. It's out of Georgia, which I've learned doesn't necessarily mean where the person that ordered it is from. Oh, yes, yeah, somebody heard our please. Somebody heard our please. Is there a note on these? This is the day of no paper. No. Oh, here we have one. Oh, this is from Madison Pepper. For kids and many thanks to the volunteers and to you. Oh, no, I'm sorry. There's even more. Please use these special dinners for anyone who is feeling a little under the weather or sad or maybe missing a buddy who has found his or, home, his or her forever home. Purrs and headbutts. To the fur kitties and many thanks to the volunteers and to you. And it's from Madison Pepper. Aw, isn't that nice? Thanks, Madison. That's really nice. And we have, uh, oh, these are all those appetizers. I'm going to do the tape now so that when we get them out, we don't have to do that. Yeah, 
have we have we don't have any of these, so do you wanna we put a few out now. The Ulsters eat these, the skinny minis eat these, and when we had trouble a few weeks a couple weeks ago with that one new litter that came in so thin, um, this is what we got them eating first. We'll put two of each kind. There's three cases of these. These are the fancy feast appetizers. I don't know. Yeah, this one's different too. This one's um, chicken and plate tuna. Chicken and sea bass and shrimp. No sardines, but shrimp is kind of close, I guess. <laughs> I put one whole um, sardine on the floor. Not the whole can, but just one sardine on the floor. And I, we had a little scrappy in this morning. I put that. Thank you. Thank you, Madison. I know these are really, this is a really good food to get those that don't want to eat to go on. And um, we have to make sure these are closed, though, Angie, because otherwise uh, Octavia will get into that cupboard. We have to cat proof, Octavia proof everything. There we go. Alright, thanks Madison. That's really awesome. Kitties are having fun back there. And this one is FedEx, FedEx Senate, and it's also from, from Petco. Oh, I think this is from Madison also, yes. Mad uh, Madison Pepper, thank you. Should we put two more? Should we put in there? Okay. There you go. Thanks, Madison. I appreciate that. Is Madison on tonight? Yeah, these are great. These really are. Thank you. It's nice that, you know what I think is really cool is that you guys thank everybody as well. And that that's just it's just really awesome. This one is interesting also. This is from um Party Pet. Uh oh, I gotta look at my code. Party Pet from M D and M D is Miraman. Yeah, me? No, uh, I didn't order any from here. From Maryland. And it's trying to pop out of the top. Oh, my gosh, this is nice. Yeah, we use these a lot. This is a gift to a feline rescue center. Oh, this is from Clarice G. in uh, Michigan also. Clarice, if you're on, thank you so much. This um, this is wonderful. You know, we never use these. These go in newcomers room too. We never used these till what, maybe a year ago, mm -hmm. and now it's like we don't. Did you ask them for Christmas cards? Yep. And did you get it though? Who got it started? Angie might have got it started on. Now it's like don't take them away because we love these. We use them. Um, so that those two are the Earth Bath Natural Grooming Wipes. And they're hypoallergenic, and we use them for ears and like Emmeline's, her whole face, the Persian faces. Um, uh, Twinkle gets her face washed two to three times a day. Putter gets his face, wa face washed a few times a day. This, these two, I believe, came today. And this one, this one is from Georgia, the state of Georgia, and it's from Cindy A. Cindy A. from Georgia, and she was here. She put two boxes together. Where? Our, uh, I wonder. Uh, we're gonna have a lot of brown paper now. Oh, 
Okay. Hey, Bill. Do you want to pull? Whoops. Maybe I don't want it all. Yeah. Okay. Uh, something my daughter sent for one of the grandkids for Christmas. <laughs> I don't know, but no, it said from Cindy, right? the string on it. Yeah, it's from is there do we know it's Cindy A from Waycross, Georgia? Maybe it's for Potter. From Waycross Potter see I've been on his own show. Oh I, Octavia used her credit card. Yeah. <laughs> if, if she did she'd be ordering lots of appetizers. I'm gonna put this this is pretty cute though. There's a what? Something in his boot. Oh, a snake. Oh, a snake in snake his boot. Yeah, this is in, uh, this is Putter's competition. I'm going to put this in here. I wonder if we might have gotten this by mistake. So we're going to have to do some detective work. So nobody's, nobody knows of a Cindy A from, it's uh, Waycross, Georgia. And... That's about all the clues we have. Maybe we can put that back in it. Um, this Paul is, can't have it. Paul can't, yeah, he, <laughs> it's butters. <laughs> so um, we'll just put that in there till we find more um, information about it. Some poor kids to get kept. <laughs> <laughs> well, I think that's kind of cute, though. <laughs> right, Bill? And... So we, we've got these two, so we'll do this one. This one's light. This is from Beverly. It's a Big C Corporation from Lafayette, Tennessee. And we have a Lafayette, Indiana, too. It's got some really cute stickers on the side. All penguin stickers and snowman penguin. Oh, she said to check the address on that, make sure it was supposed to go to Friends of Feline. Yeah, it's actually, it has, um, it says Jackie Moss instead of friends of feline so the only thing I can think of is you? unless yeah. unless because Karen's ordering I gave her money to buy the grandkids stuff and she was going to send them here but she did not tell me about this that. dude that what's his name dude Woody. Joe Woody Woody yeah she didn't tell me about that one so um I will have to find out <coughs> You know, sometimes when you order from, what is it, Amazon and eBay, eBay that you don't know, it doesn't come by Amazon, or uh, the yeah, Amazon, so you don't always know. They, they are sometimes, but I, I think they have uh, church tonight. No, it's night Tuesday yesterday. I'm still all messed up with things. It's not Wednesday. It's not Wednesday. <laughs> no, because we went to the doctor today. This is Beverly, Big C Corporation, Lafayette. And we have a card. Oh, this is nice. Here's a bag for Hannah's Christmas cards, which is what I wanted to talk to you about. And and we have our fresh step, Paul Point. You know, see, there's one up there. Can you just hook those with that? Thanks for the Paul Point. Aw, oh, this is really cool. This is something after our boxes I'll talk to you all about. Aww. Oh, man. 
Let's get that crazy bird. Look at this. So, so this is from um, Beverly Beverly G. Beverly G. made this, and it's the bag that we're going to put Hannah's Christmas cards in. And I'll explain more of that when we're done here. But um, isn't that awesome? We'll send it all in this. Even the sides are decorated. Beverly, this is really awesome. Look at that. Wow. It's a changing bed house. Did you see that? Mm -hmm. Isn't that cool? That really is. Very creative. Wow. Beverly, that's pretty cool. She's going to love that. Um, and we got a card. And we also have over here... This is the extent of my artwork. <laughs> Which one should we do? Uh, gee. <laughs> Somebody gave me a card to date for her already, so this one's kind of fast. So um, we've got two, two cards in there already then. And I think we'll keep this down in pin five so that the kitties don't get it. That's really, really, really awesome. So we'll put this in there behind the keyboard. And we'll just put it there. This box kind of fell apart during shipment, but by golly, they got it here. And it's from Amazon, and it is in almost in bits and pieces here. Find the piece of paper. Uh oh. I like everything. Oh, yep, yeah, here we go. I'm a little detective when it comes to looking for paper. Oh, but there's no name on it. Okay. Hopefully you guys, somebody will clean it. Yep, it's a big box. And we have, this is a assortment. This is 32 cans of the Frisky, the purple. 32 cans of the Frisky. <laughs> Weasley, Weasley is conked out. And then uh, four cases. That's kind of weird. Sounds like a dried food almost, but it can't be. Isn't that kind of strange? The I'm holding it tight. All right, I gotta open that just because I can't stand to try this. I know it's the packet. Maybe there's a big mouse in it. There's four packets oh. of uh, whiskers, and these are the yeah of the four packets of the poultry whiskers. So in this one so far, we had the 32 friskies, four packs of uh, whiskers. Angie, let me check here. We might need one up here. Yeah. Do that. There you go, baby. Oh, Einstein, you're pathetic. And this one, we'll just open it. I'm just going to try to, it's frisky as it says. Oh, this is the gravy, the gravy sensation. You know, I confessed a few days ago that I took a couple of these inside to see if um, a killer would start eating, and this is what she started eating. Um, it's got lots of great, it's a gravy sensations pouch, so it's um, a 24 pack of the frisky gravy sensations, and there's six different flavors in there. The kitties like that. This is one that always fooled me because it says Mars. I always, of course, think of candy bars first. Oh, what the? oh, we were out of these. This is the 
um, whiskers, perfectly chicken, and uh, boy, there won't be much tearing that one apart, will it, Bill? <laughs> so, um, yeah, we were out of these, so thank you. Do we know who sent these? Now, hi, PJ. Do we, does any, did anybody claim the four pack of food that came in this box? Oh, she's lurking. Okay, well, hi, PJ, though. PJ is in the house. Yeah, I'm glad, I'm glad Aprilla ate it. <laughs> Weezy's paws are sticking up there. Here, Weezy boy. And who else we got here? Let's look under the tail. This is Chia. Chia-chia-chia-chia. Oh, yeah, we got all kinds of stuff here and there. I mean, this is 7 o'clock and we're still going. I love this. Never any cleaning box yet. Wow. Um, well, we'll finish. We'll do these. There's four, four packets. Um, this one says mining on it. So I'm wondering if this is another one of the grandkids stuff. I don't think so. I think this, I'm going to bet you this is Kellen's. I'm going to put this over here. It's got to be Kellen's. I guess I need to stop and take time to get Karen's message off the, my email so I can see what's coming. This one I know is not for Christmas things. It's Wendy W. from, um, I got to look at my cheat sheet again. Okay. Oh, this is from Alaska. Eagle River, Alaska. Oh, yeah, Alaskan catnip. First class Ooh. for the kitties. Wow, clear from Alaska. Is Wendy W. on from... The, whoops, wait. Oh, is this from you? Is it is it Leany? Is that how I pronounce that? You told me you had mentioned that you had sent something. Oh, yes, Colleen. Oh, this is Colleen from Colleen. You did tell me that. This Colleen is, go is going to be the mama to Donna, who's running around like a wild thing, and to our, our Weasley. Oh, wow. Oh, they got a card. Love these cards. Merry Christmas from Catnip for the Kitties. Happy Holidays from Colleen. And Samson and Delilah are the two cats that she already has. And it's from... Um, the place she got it must be Wendy's Wacky Kitty Tobacky. <laughs> oh my gosh, look at these. These are Man, uh, Matan, oh, Mananuska, Ma Thunderstruck, close enough, Alaskan Catnip, a treat for your kitties. The high potency catnip growing in the beautiful Mantas, yeah, and I know I'm saying that really wrong. Famous for its fertile farm farmlands and long growing days. We have to smell one of these. Oh boy, we'll we'll get two of these out, and um, today, yeah, we'll we'll hide the rest until we we can get them out. Oh, look at this one. I'll do this one tonight for the kitties. Um, Today, one of the kitties I had, one of the new toys from last week, a catnip one from last week opened, um, and they've been playing with it. You know, they, they're just so rough on everything, and one of them was laying up there on the desk while I was doing um, my emails and busted it open. There was catnip everywhere, and even though I swept it up, the kitties could still smell it. So all day long while I was at the desk, they were also there at the desk helping me all day. So thank you. There's... Um, there's these we're going to give. Do you want that, Burka? Are you here, Burka? Smell that, baby girl. Here, you wild things. And there's four other, three other packets and one bag that has some really interesting looking catnip in there. 
Were you were you on when we got the what looked like marijuana? Last <laughs> one, it was a, a catnip marijuana looking toy. This one is from Amanda and Katie K from Florida. And isn't it cool how this stuff comes from all over? It's amazing. Astounding and amazing. And we got a letter. Kit Kat and Angel. And then in parentheses, Amanda and Katie. And it's two FFRC. Oh, it's a happy holiday. Aw, uh, how are you? Hi, Jackie, how are you? Me and my mom would like to say happy holidays to everyone at FFRC. We enjoy watching the webcam. It brings us such joy as we, oh, as we can't have any cats. The picture is of, I'm sorry, the picture is my mom's background. Oh, on her computer. I, I thought it was right there. I included a toy for the cats for their holiday present. Thank you, everyone at FFRC, for all the hard work that you do. To Jackie, volunteers, cats, and all your friends and family, from Amanda and Katie, and they are their cam names are Kit Kat and Angel. Check out the. Oh, she took it right from me. That's on the web or on their computer front. Thank you, Kit Kat and Angel. Can you guys see over here? Oh, oh my golly. That's Siri. <laughs> well, we can definitely say she likes catnip. So, let's see what Amanda and Katie have sent us. And I'm, I'm putting all our Christmas cards up on our card wall. And this... I like how she's flipping that. Oh, this looks like fun for the kitties. And this came clear, like we said, from Florida. Aw, this is so nice of you. Oh, look at this. They will love this. Thank you for that. Can you see that? Um, I'm going to put that together, and it, it's on a stick, and then it's got this little suction thing here. So we'll do that. Isn't that awesome? They'll like that. We'll try that one tonight. I'm going to put that over here, and I'll set that up for them tonight. Thanks, Amanda and Katie. I appreciate that. And I'm going to save your address. Paul got cut tonight, this afternoon. He was putting things away, and uh, he was getting putting some of our metal parts away that we use and metal siding and he kind of flipped and pushed and gouged his, uh, what's it, his pointer, I think pretty bad. So we put a, a butterfly band-aid on it and got it all fixed up for him. Gave him a little bit of sympathy. This is Friends of Felines with beautiful stamp. And I think this is our last one. Boy, the cats are going crazy with all that paper, aren't they? Oh, this is cute, too. Oh, my gosh. You guys all find the coolest toys. <laughs> this is a sardine. Gift set. It's assorted catnip toys, a wand, three attachments, two toys. <laughs> oh my gosh, I love sardines. I think I'm not going to live that one down. I'm going to save this one until, um, like in a couple more days, where we uh, use up some of them that we have. Can you catch that out? Here's the stick that you put it on. There's three sardine toys and uh, two other ones. And it looks like we can put them all on this wand here. These wand toys are fun. Thank you. But we don't know who it's from. It's a sardine lover, though. I know it. It's got to be. 
Yeah, thank you. This one doesn't have a name on it, so isn't that cute? There's all so much fun stuff. Yes, yes, Cottage. Need a quick drink first here. I do have, before we get into our notes, I do have um, I had a couple postcards. There we go. We got two postcards. This one is really cool. Do you, you know where to put those at, Angie? This is from Washington. I can put this up here so they don't Okay, good idea. That's from Washington. And it's... Oh, this is from Cheryl Ann, our webcam friend, Cheryl Ann 275. It says, Greetings from beautiful Washington oh. State. I live 15 miles from here, and it definitely is God's country. I so appreciate all you do for those very special cats. You are you are a saint. With my volunteers that are saints. <laughs> I feel so blessed to have found the FFRC cam. I spent a lot of time watching everything going on there, and love the setup you have there. I love the volunteers. Love the volunteers, Andy. And you for all your hard work. God bless you, Cheryl Ann, 275. And this is uh, located, this picture is located on Puget Sound. Um, provides beautiful views of Mount Rainier. I love these ones, especially of Washington. My sister Patty used to live there, and I've, I've seen a lot of this country, and it is definitely God's country. Beautiful, beautiful country. Thank you, Cheryl Ann. We'll add that to our cork board. Cool. Thank you for the kind words also. This is from Dallas. Oh, this is from our friend Kathy B. Um, she's from Forney. I think it's pronounced Forney, Texas. Greetings from Dallas, Texas. Thank you for all you do. Being able to watch your cats has been a blessing for me. All the best. Kathy B. 12 from Forney, Texas. Pretty cool. Thank you, Kathy. I've, I've driven, when we went on a trip out west, I dro we drove through Dallas, or Texas, but I didn't get to see too much of it. Pretty cool. We'll add both of these to our our um, course board. And then we have two cards here yet, and then we'll get to our things that we have. Um, out on the other side of the gate, do you mind? Mm -hmm. Oh, this, this is from some local friends of the Rescue Center. It's a Christmas card. Isn't that nice? And they donated um, some money for Christmas for the holidays. This is from Don and Kay Kay. Don and Kay Kay here in Defiance. And I'll put this also on our card, um, on our card wall. Thank you, Don and Kay. You guys are pretty cool people. I appreciate your support. Sometimes Kay comes and she brings her grandkids here. Oh, this is from Andrea A. from Ohio City, Ohio. Wishing you a bright and merry Christmas. Dear friends, thinking of you at Christmas and hoping your blessings continue through the year. Andrea. So this is Andrea A. Uh, Christmas card. And we'll put this also on our card wall. Thanks, Andrea. I love the chickadees on the front. Oh, it's fun to get these cards and the postcards and, of course, the boxes. You know, you guys are, are all pretty awesome to us. I don't know what we do without your help. And, and I sincerely mean that. I don't say that just easily um, without without a lot of feeling because you guys are so important to us. Um, back on Hannah's cards that we have now to love. Uh, 
Stephna down there in Donna are playing, and Weasley. That little Stephna is just a little jerk. I didn't figure I had out. Okay, thank you for helping me. I put those toys on the top shelf. It looks like there's a room down okay. below. Okay, thank you. Thank you. Okay, all right. Sounds good. I think she, I think he's gonna get better and better. Yeah. Yeah. He's doing better. Okay. Thanks for helping him. Yep. No problem. Okay. <laughs> nope. It'll be better. I can feel already it's leaking you not. But yeah. Thank you. Yep. Okay. We'll see you later. So Hannah is our little friend. I believe she's nine years old, and. Uh, she has some medical issues that keeps her at home, but she loves the webcam. And Hannah, if you're on, hi, and close your ears for a minute because we're going to do a surprise. If any of you would like to send a Christmas card here for Hannah, we're collecting them. And it just can be a simple Christmas card. She loves, loves, loves cats. And uh, you can just uh, send a regular card to FFRC somewhere on the outside of the envelope, put Hannah, H-A-N-N-A-H, and I will collect them and mail them all to her along with that wonderful cool bag that uh, we have to put the cards in. So if you'd like to do that, Hannah, we try to send once a month pictures of different kitties here to Hannah, and then, and then she and her family always answer the back. So uh, she's a pretty cool girl, uh, just a, a lot of issues that keep her at home, and she loves to watch the webcam. Uh, I did hear, we got good news, I heard from Hudson and Cobbett, and Hudson, the little white baby, went to a home with two boys, and all is well there. Um, <laughs> these are nuts. The uh, two boys that Hudson belongs to love them. Um, or love Hudson and all is well there they're, they're just doing really fine and then I also heard from Cobbis and the, the resident cat there is slowly but surely taking a liking to Cobbis but Cobbis is extremely happy it sounds like very contented the mom said so all is well and good with Hudson and Cobbis I just wanted to thank um, the people who helped us today. Angie and Bill just left. Also, Stacy, Jean, uh, Jean K was here this morning, and then tonight was um, our other Jean, our Friday night Jean. Judy S was here today. Connie and Carrie and Paul are all the people that pitched in and helped us today to get through today. You guys, you scared yourself, didn't you? You scared me, too. You're nutty. Um, I know that probably sounds like a tornado through the webcam. Um, KW's neck is a whole lot better. Uh, I went back to the kind of collar where it doesn't have the yarn on it. I don't know if it needed the extra moist, the extra air there, but that wound is finally healing good, and uh, he's back to his old self again. I, I know that I had to hurt him so badly. Um... So all is okay there. Sometime in this month, we're going to have a surgery day to get the few kitties that are left that we haven't haven't uh, stayed and neutered, uh, so that we'll be 100% again on our neutering. And um, Amy, Amy M, she's our defiance friend that does our pictures for pet finders. She's going to be coming, I think. Saturday, Sunday, or Monday. She wasn't sure which day, but she'll be here. And um, <laughs> and uh, take the rest of the pictures. So that means tomorrow I've got to get cracking and get my the rest of my things added because I haven't added like the pea litter, the pea kitty litters. I haven't got them in, and I don't have some of these others that have come in that's already spayed or neutered. So we got to I got to get those done too. And um, Siri, you all saw her tonight. She is still working on the one uh, catnip bag that came from uh, Colleen from Alaska. She, she's all over it here in her pen. And right now she just laid down and it's on her chest and nobody better take it away from her. I didn't know she was such a catnip nut. I don't know also if you saw, if you read our uh, blog today, but Mercy is back. 
And uh, the owner, very, very sad to have had to have brought Mayor Sue back. Remember her? She's our our uh, white calico. She's mostly white. She has calico markings on her head and a little on her, a little bit on her body and her tail. And uh, she, she, the mama, when she adopted Mercy, she fell in love with Mercy from the very first time she saw her. Uh, she had expressed a little concern about her resident cat being not sure about Mercy coming in. And it did develop where the resident cat became quite a bully, a bossy, I guess I should say. I don't want to sound mean, um, but a little bullyish. And uh, it got to the point where he, he would, she would not let Mercy alone. So it was decided, very sad decision by the mama, that she would rather give Mercy back than to have her have to live like that, cowering because of her resident cat. So a lot of tears, a lot of sadness on that one. Mercy, um, remember she always liked cats for the two campus room. Uh, but I put her in uh, Dodger's pen to acclimate her back to being here, but she really didn't even need that time because she, she immediately um, got back in the scoop of things, and today she made her way back to her favorite room. You know, we had this stuff all pushed away because I know the crinkling noise interferes with the cam audio, so I'm really sorry about all that. Ellie. Oh my gosh, these guys are crazy. You guys are going to have to come and calm these kitties down before bedtime. Um, they're crazy. I love it, though. I I absolutely love crazy kitties. I just have one more thing to say. Or oh, two more things to say. Steve and I went to Lima today. It's about an hour away. And... Um, if for his third opinion, and that third doctor definitely agreed that Steve had to have a new knee. We all knew that, but we have to go through the through the hoops that they say we have to jump through for workman's comp. So now he's going to file his report on Monday, and as soon as that gets to workman's comp, they w I'm, I know now that they will agree that we can go ahead with the surgery. So um, hopefully we can get that scheduled ASAP. So we're making headway. This is our stats from Pet Finders. They give us weekly report and stats. And uh, they have us down for last week. Our total views was 2,453. 2,453. Um, that's our total views for one week. That's pretty high. That's pretty high. And anybody got a guess who our top one or two or three kitties are? Anybody got a guess who you might think would be our top three? <laughs> we do. Whoop. Yeah, there's two answers that are right. Well, you got, you got two of them. The top one is Tasco. Tasco got 116 hits. The second one is Shasta. Isn't that awesome? Shasta with 101. And then number three is a Nani. 94. Oh, actually, number four is also 94. And that's Hobbit. And then it was Dulce, Jeepers, Zelda, my Zelda girl, Hudson, Tugger. Still on there. Tweeny, Zoom, Adora, Bumblebee, Ramanese, and Nuki. Nuki. And then there's another whole page of them as they go down the line. So, pretty cool. So, it was 2,453 hits last week. And um, that is all that I have. I just wanted to ask if you can all still continue to vote. Our last day of voting is. Uh, December 17th. I think that's right. I think it's December 17th. That's on a Saturday. And then they announce the winners, I believe, on the 21st. I think that that's right. So right now we're still in first place. We got a nice little lead. But, oh, my, I just hope we can hang on to that lead. And, yeah, please, everybody vote. 
um, just don't let up. Just keep on voting and uh, help us out on that. I would just love to be able to win that. I remember the very first time that we were involved in this voting and I thought, I was in awe of that first place one because it's like, holy moly, how could, that is just, it's just awesome to be, to be one like that. And now after I think it's four or five quarters, we're it. And it's just still mind-boggling to me that Friends of Felines in Little Old Defiance, Ohio could be up there. And it just is really cool. Um, so now next, but uh, wait, who just said that? Do, 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 wildfire adult. Next, now the way I was told that because this year is almost over that it starts over again in January your rankings and all that and I think that we can actually if you win the the fourth round and then the next year when they start it for the first round you can do a back-to-back -back grand prize so who knows we'll see we'll see so I thank everybody from the bottom of my heart you guys are so giving so compassionate so wonderful and I am full of gratitude for all of your help. I appreciate it very much. So, too bad you guys are here. You can help me clean up and um, have to deal with these monsters. They're just crazy tonight. And thank you for joining us. I so, I so appreciate it. Well, I am blessed to have all of your help and your friendship and you all being a part of, of what we do here. You guys are awesome. Thank you. All right, baby Kate. Could you guys help me clean up? I'll give you an extra toy. What do you think of that? Okay. Uh, what do you think of that? Let me go clean up this part and then we'll get you done. Can you all see our Bella girl? She says, don't tip me over. Here, let's turn this one off so we can see the hand down there after a look at that. Okay, we'll put it right, right about there. Thank you. 